So, girl, let's get into the story because this is, um, <sighs> this is, this is a lot. This one's a lot. I'm gonna put my hair up because I have to do my face real quick. Oh yeah, did I say this was a get on ready with me? This is what this is because I'm ready to go to bed. Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maisha or Mai, but you can follow me on, <sighs> yo. Ah, ah, ah. Slow down. It's like, it's like, I don't even know what to say no more. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Maisha. I also go by Mai or Placid, not Placid, Princess Placid. I don't really care what you call me. Just watch your mouth. Did it. <laughs> so today's video is going to be another get on ready with me because that was really fun the last time I made that one. And um, I already got in the shower and everything. I got my robe on, you know. My helmet of salvation is missing right now i don't know where my helmet of salvation is but it's okay i retwisted my hair so it's not that bad today but today's story is gonna be about how first of all i had this i had this memory when i was in the shower um i remember this date that i went on and it was like <laughs> i feel bad because this guy really liked me like he's liked me for years and i've just never given him the time of day and like one day I was just like, all right, let's just go on a date. So a little bit of backstory. Um, me and this guy were like texting back when I was in high school. Mind you, I'm almost 24. I'm 23 right now. I was in high school, I don't even know, what, six years ago? I don't know. I was in high school a long time ago. This guy, he, we would talk and all, and he introduced me to his cousin. And me and his cousin actually ended up being cooler than me and him because he was just awkward like his cousin had a little bit more like i hate this word but like he had a little bit more finesse <laughs> <laughs> like he was just a little bit more graceful than him like dude was just a little bit corny so it didn't really work out for me and him me and his cousin was cool and i don't know why me and him stopped talking i feel like he got like a girlfriend or something i don't know his yeah his cousin so this guy he would like just be on me like you know you better get out of my face out of my face out of my face back then we when i was in high school we went i told him he can pick me up because i didn't have a car in high school i told him he can pick me up we can go to the mall i wanted to get my nails done and go shopping so oh my god all the memories are coming back we went to the mall we're in forever 21 i'm shopping you know doing my thing and he's like feeling on me and I'm just like, don't touch me. I'm still like that. Like, if I don't like you like that, like if we're not together, even if we are together, some situations, like if you see me doing something. Can you let me do what I need to do? I need you to back up and let me do what I needs to do. Like he's all feeling on me and shit. I'm like, yo, back up, please. Just space. He's like, oh, what you getting mad for? Bro, personal space. That's what I'm getting mad for. Back up. That was strike number one. In the nail salon, I'm not in the nail salon, in the mall, there's this nail salon that I really like. Um, so I was like, I'm ready to go get my nails done. And he took, he went with me to go, go get my nails done. He said something. I don't remember what he said, but I had like a big attitude at that point. I was just like, man, man, this nigga's annoying. That was strike number two. And then he was like, uh, let's get something to eat so we go to the food court and mind you i'm not a religious person but i'm respectful of other people's religions like very respectful of other people's um religions as long as they don't try to force it upon other people so he's christian i am so um we get food and he's one of those people who prays before he eats and that's completely okay you want to pray before you eat i personally will not eat until you're done praying like just me being respectful and um he was like you're not gonna pray before you eat i said i don't do that and he gave me this like like a and i was just like did i do all that to you when you when you started praying i didn't do any of that that was strike number three. So I was just like, yeah, just take me home. No, he said something to me after that. I don't know what he said, but he said something to me after that. And I was like, that's it. Take me home. 
takes me home that was years ago i haven't talked to this man since then so he randomly pops up this was like 2019 randomly pops up i used to work at a spa so i'm at work he texts me he was like hey i just want to take you out one more time da, 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 da. i'm like okay whatever sure why not and in my head i'm like okay cool free food like I, it was one of those things i know i shouldn't be like that but it was definitely one of those things i'm so mad i don't have screenshots i'm so mad i don't have screenshots but whatever like he was texting me he was texting me he was like so where do you want to go what do you want to eat and i'm like so what do you like to eat he was like it doesn't really matter like wherever you want to go i'm down and i'm like have you ever had sushi he's like sushi sounds cool da 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 and i'm like oh cool there's a sushi place out where i used to live at um we can go out there and i really like the place so i was just like yeah we can go but da, da, da. i haven't been there in a minute so he's like all right cool you want me to pick you up or you want to drive there i was like i'm gonna drive myself i i got this i'm gonna just be getting off work i'm gonna just swing by there after i get off work and he's like all right cool so i get there i'm sitting in my car i'm like getting nervous because it's like i haven't seen this man since i like kirked on him so i was a little nervous and um uh, he gets there, I see him, it was like awkward, like I kinda, like we did one of them like side hugs, it was awkward. So, <laughs> so we go in there, we sit down and he's like, he's like, uh, I never had sushi before so I don't know if I'm gonna like this. And I was just like, why would you agree to go to a sushi restaurant if you never had sushi before? Like the restaurant has other stuff like other than sushi, but like it's a predominantly sushi like restaurant so like what uh, i don't know what he was thinking so we're in the sushi restaurant he's telling me how he doesn't have he's never had sushi i'm looking at him crazy mind you i'm fried like i was fried because i didn't know what was ready happen so i was just like you know what, let me just just a little bit okay a little, a little you know we're talking and he he brought up the fact that we had went on a date prior to this and he was like, do you remember when we went out like a long time ago, like 2000, I think it was like 2014, 13 type shit. Like it was a long time ago. And mind you, this was in 2019. And I was like, yeah, I remember, but I don't remember everything. And then right, like literally right when I said that, this man's whole attitude changed. Like he went from being cool to like fidgety. Like he's sitting there, he's like, so, uh, do you remember when we went on a date and, and, and like, you just stopped talking to me? And I'm like, yeah. And he was like, so what was your reason for like not talking to me no more? I was like, um, I don't remember what happened, but I feel like I felt disrespected. So I didn't want to date, like, I didn't want to continue to date anymore. And then he was like, I remember that day like it was yesterday. I still remember where you live at. Mind you, this man has not seen me since 2014, 13, 14. So he's like, yeah, I still remember where you live at. And then starts describing my neighborhood to me. Like describe like the what my ho the houses look like the little roundabout all of that he was describing my entire neighborhood to me and i'm just like how do you remember this and he's like i'm not a creep i swear i don't be just chilling around your neighborhood i just got a good memory i said i ain't even bring that up i ain't even bring <laughs> i ain't even say nothing about that so what are you doing around my neighborhood <laughs> is my only thought so i'm eating and i'm eating it's getting quiet he's like staring at me and i'm just like oh my god <laughs> i'm like this man is a, a murderer the date's going he's trying to get me to drink like he's really trying to get me to drink he's like you don't want to try the alcohol menu i was like no i'm i'm good i don't really drink like that he's like you sure I'll pay for it? No, I'm fine. I'm good. I'm good. Don't worry about it. But you sure? I, I mean, I got... No, it's fine. It's fine. It's okay. I don't want nothing. It's okay. Ma'am, can we get the alcohol on me? And then he starts looking at the venue and I'm just like, I said I don't want alcohol. Like, 
clicking what's not clicking the date's over it's coming to an end and i i just walked out the restaurant he like goes in to hug me i i do one of them little side hugs again and then he tries to walk me to my car mind you i park like in the front like there's two lanes like two parking lanes or whatever and then i parked the restaurant is here i parked like here and he parked like in this area I don't, I don't know how to really show it but like my car was a little bit to the side like a little bit more in the dark i wasn't thinking girl i wasn't thinking and then his car was like more in front of the restaurant but like the lane behind the front lane where my car was i don't know i'm not that good at explaining stuff so he walks me to my car i open my pat my driver's seat i mean my driver door he's like trying to talk to me but he's getting closer to me so i have my keys hold on i have my keys and on my keys, I have pepper spray. And I keep that pepper spray on me, baby girl. I keep it right here. So I pop that, pop that bad boy open. As I was walking to my car, I did all of this in one hand. As I'm walking to my car, I was ready. I was ready to pepper spray that tail. He tried to lean in for a hug and I was like, bro, I'm ready to go home. Like, <laughs> like I don't even want to be here no more. Like I'm ready to go home. And the next morning, he, I had texted him. I was like, yo, last night was like real creepy. Like you describing my neighborhood back to me after not coming to my house for like years is weird. Um, I, last night was cool. Like the conversation was cool up until the point where you brought up the fact that we went on a date and I kind of ghosted you. I didn't really like that. So I would, I would like really respect if we never talked again type shit. I don't have an explanation for you and you may not get one. That's it. As far as I'm concerned, the issue is dead. I'm moving forward. Now you can continue to go backwards if you want to, but I'm not gonna go backwards with you. And he was like, yeah, I kinda knew I messed up when I brought up how your neighborhood look, like what your neighborhood look like. I swear I don't just be in your neighborhood, da 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 da. I'm like, you're weird. <laughs> so um, I ended up blocking him on everything. Blocked him on Twitter, blocked him on Instagram, blocked his number, all of that. He was just mad weird and the idea of this story popped up in my head when I was in the shower. I don't know why. I think it's because it's around his birthday and I think this is what like Aries season and I just want to say I don't like Aries like that. So yeah all of my bad stories is really with Aries or like Sagittarius. But fire signs all together like fire signs just me and fire sign i'm an earth sign i'm a virgo me and fire signs we just don't we just don't get along like that so yeah that's the whole video if you liked it let me know leave the thumbs up leave a comment share subscribe bro i'm messing up all these words right now um but if you like my content definitely uh subscribe to the channel give it a thumbs up tell your friends about me follow me on all my platforms twitter instagram Princess Placid in the <laughs> What am I even talking about? Bye, you guys.